Over the last few years, the database landscape has experienced a rapid evolution. The days of the one-size-fits-all monolithic database are behind us and developers are now building highly distributed applications using a multitude of purpose-built databases. In every planning discussion that I have been a part of, the question of what is the purpose has to be answered. Purpose is what should drive all of our decisions. When developers begin discussing the requirements for a new application, the architecture of the systems the application will interact with affects every decision. Unfortunately, this discussion commonly ends with we have a relational database, so how do we ensure our applications fit into those requirements? That's the wrong focus. The developers should instead ask what type of data store will best fulfill the needs of the application. That's the purpose of this video. This is Farhana and welcome to my channel. In this video, I am helping you to understand how to frame these discussions in a new way that helps your organization to exceed the limitations of the existing data structures. A purpose-built database is about having the right tool for the job. Here is a high-level stats how multiple database products are being used in the large organizations. If you see closely, a large percentage of databases is purpose-built. That's right. Let's say you need to haul a mattress across town. A pickup truck is the ideal tool for this job. But if you need to move 10 dozen packages across country, you probably don't want to use that pickup truck. It would take several trips and it just wouldn't be very efficient. Now, a tractor trailer is a far better fit for this scenario. In the past, data was commonly modeled as relational just because it was the only widely available choice for databasing. Instead of the use case or application driving the requirements for the database, the database engine was driving the application design. The thing is, not all application data models or use cases match the relational model. Selecting the right use case for each database type can significantly improve your database performance and user experience. When talking about database solutions, the one-size-fits-all database is no longer a viable option. Very few organizations have use cases where one database type can meet their needs. It's far more common that organizations need to identify database solutions for multiple distinct uses. The logistical barriers that prevented a single application from interacting with multiple data source types are no longer a driving factor in database selection. Okay, so here you see the most widely used databases and types of data services and their brand names with Azure and AWS. Those data services are mainly categorized by the types relational, no SQL key value, no SQL document, no SQL graph, data warehouse, and database cache. And here you see the AWS database services by the database types. AWS has Amazon RSD for relational databases, DynamoDB for key value or document, Neptune for graph, LST cache for in-memory, and Amazon Elasticsearch service for indexing and searching. Having a purpose-built database solution means that you get better performance. Let's explore the key database types with some of the most common use cases to identify the right database recommendation. Use case number one, if you have a business case to build online transaction processing, OLTP, application, and your business require a red heavy transactional database, OLTP, then you should select relational database. In this online transaction processing, OLTP, application, relational database service is used with a read replica, which is asynchronously updated. Relational database read replicas make it easy to elastically scale out for read-heavy database workloads beyond the capacity constraints of a single database instance. You can create one or more replicas of a given source database instance and serve high-volume application read traffic from multiple copies of your data, thereby increasing aggregate read throughput. 
Use case number two. In this business case, if you have requirement to build media streaming, then you should select cache database. For instance, if you are using AWS Cloud, then Amazon S3 Cache offers a fast in-memory data store to power live streaming use cases. S3 Cache can store metadata for user profiles and viewing history, authentication information tokens for millions of users, and manifest files to enable content delivery networks to stream videos to millions of mobile and desktop users at a time. Use case number three. If you are a gaming business and looking to build a gaming application, then you should select key value databases. Companies in the gaming industry use Amazon DynamoDB or Azure Cosmos DB or Google Bigtable in all aspects of game platforms, including game state, player data, session history, and leaderboards. Unlike relational database, Key Value Database is able to automatically scale to millions of concurrent users and requests while ensuring consistently low latency measured in single-digit milliseconds. In this use case, let's say in AWS environment, player data is stored in DynamoDB for analytics to determine player behavior and usage patterns. Use cases such as gaming, advertising tech, shopping carts. And IoT lend themselves particularly well to the key value data model of DynamoDB. In this use case, Amazon Simple Storage Service, Amazon S3, and Amazon Cloud Front are managing and serving media content. S3 Cache manages the content index and token authentication for in-memory sub-milliseconds responses at scale. Use case number four. Let's say in this scenario you are working for a bank. And your organization wants to build a fraud detection application, and you are looking for the right fit for database selection. In this use case, you will select some knowledge graph database. As unlike relational database, knowledge graph builds semantic network, represents a network of real-world entities, i.e., objects, events, situations, or concepts, and illustrates the relationship between them. So let's say we using AWS environment, then you will recommend Amazon Mapertune. Amazon Mapertune allows you to use existing information resources to build knowledge graphs and host them on a fully managed service. A knowledge graph allows you to store information in a graph model and use graph queries to enable your users to easily navigate highly connected datasets. In this use case, comma separated value (CSV). A resource description framework (RDF) data is loaded from Amazon S3 to Neptune. The client application then uses simple Sparkle queries to build graphical visualizations. Using a knowledge graph, you can add topical information to product catalogs, build and query complex models of regulatory rules, or model general information. Use case number five. In this scenario, let's consider you are building a social media application. You are looking for a database selection for user profile management. Your choice of selection would be document database. Let's assume here you are on AWS Cloud. You will go for Amazon Document DB. User profile management enables online transactions, user preferences, and user authentication. With the growth in number of users, increasingly complex user profile data, and growing user experience expectations, the demand for scalability, data flexibility, and performance has grown too. With Amazon Document DB's document data model, you can manage profiles and preferences for millions of users and scale to process millions of user requests per second with millisecond latency. Developers can process data with Amazon Document DB by using the same document model format that they use in their application code. Content management, personalization, and mobile applications are typical use cases. Here is a detailed comparison of AWS, Azure, and GCP databases types and its comparisons. As you can see from here, what cloud technology is offering and what are the different options available for you to choose. Regardless of the cloud provider, selecting the right database type will make you win.